First of all, thank you so much for talking to us, Nikki. I can't believe I'm doing this. But it's okay. <laughs> you guys play uh, play at Rock in Rio, but not in Brazil. It's your first time this year. What are you expecting? It's going to be in Rio in September, I believe. Yeah. And I'm expecting a lot. A or, lot. <laughs> a lot. Because how, if you gather up uh, two or three hundred thousand of you people here in this country, now it's going to be absolutely nuts, you know. But we've done, we done a lot of shows here in Brazil and it's always crazy. It's always crazy. Uh, I just expect that I will play good drums, <laughs> pretty much. And we will sound good with Motorhead, you know. I'm sure. <laughs> and then, if you guys suck, that's okay too. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sure everyone's going to enjoy it. I can guarantee you one thing. We will not suck. I'm sure. We will be good. <laughs> nice. Uh, talking about rock and roll, uh, is there some new band that you like? Or you know now? Nothing new. There, there, there's so many good young bands. Here's a great band right here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, great musicians. The only problem with the band right here is maybe they should uh, listen a little bit more to each other. They play great songs and they're good individually, but I like to hear a little tighter feel. You play with Pink Diamond and Don't Donkey? Did you enjoy playing with his bands? Yeah, of course. I mean, King Diamond, King Diamond, we were a bunch of friends, you know. And uh, Dokken was also a bunch of friends. <laughs> and Motorhead is also a bunch of friends. I don't know how many friends I have. I gotta start counting them now, but he but, but went in the right direction, right steps. You know, we were young. Uh, to tell you the truth, we have we had no idea what we were doing. <laughs> we do we did, but we didn't know what effect it would have. And I don't know about here in South America because we never came down here. Yes. But in North America we were huge. Huge. But in Europe we were shit. No one cared about us. But in in, in US we were massive. And uh, I do sign a lot of the old Abigail and conspiracy and stuff, which is great, you know. But we were a bunch of guys, friends, wrote music, went on tour, had a good time. And with Dawkins, it was a great band. Uh, let's talk about The Award Is Yours. Uh, do you have a favorite song? All the songs are good and all the songs are shit, really, you know. Not shit, but no, I can't say I have a favorite. Because I like to listen to some songs, and I like to play some other songs. So, songs for me are different if I drive a car, or if I make love, or whatever I do. Music is different, you know. So it's hard for me. Our own album, I don't know. It's hard to say. I used to say that album is like books. You cannot read one chapter. i tell you what I'm happy about. Yeah, exactly. You can't just read one chapter. I'm happy that the whole album overall, after you listen to the whole album, you like the album. That's more important than maybe two great songs and, and ten rest. shit songs. Yes. Uh, That's yeah. what makes a great yeah. album happy. I think so. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you very much. <laughs>